Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Supermarket Simulator. When we last left off, we were on our way to level 81 so we can get the next four licenses. After that, I think there's only one license left. Um, hopefully we have enough money to get at least one, so without further ado, let's jump back in. This box, every time I load in, here it is, in the way. And is the paint there? Yep, the paint's there. That's just, just so fun. Anyway... I did play a little bit off screen. It doesn't show right now, but we're halfway to level 81 unless we lost levels because sometimes it do be like that. If you play, um, here, let's buy one of these coffees real quick and I will show you. I did play off camera. It's going to make us play all the way through level 81 again, isn't it? The losing level thing is like the most devastating thing. No, no, no. We'll hit level 81 and then we'll get the license. Yeah, yeah. So we're almost through, we're like, I would say 80% through level 80. Um, and yeah, so let's start the day and that should get us there. I only ended up playing one day after the last stream. So, hello, box. Um, they just like sometimes don't throw away boxes. I don't know what the deal is. Um, uh, so we probably could have done it last time. Um, well, we would have had to play two days, I think. It would have been, like, another hour. Oh my god, guys, come on. Do your job. This is me, like, filling, re-changing out items. Hello? Hello? That's where they're gonna stay. it make you look bad, not me. Hopefully there's no other boxes that I tossed over here that they just decided not to throw out for some reason. No. Anyway. Yeah, so it looks like we were, whenever we ended last time, we were only two days away from getting that level 81, which, of course, we were. Of course. So I only ended up playing one day and then refilling everything. I did the uh, go through and try to clean out, like, half full boxes. Obviously, I didn't do them all, but I did my best. That's all we can really hope for. Um, I think I did the sale items already. Just want to double check. I usually do that at the beginning of the day. Cat food. Yeah, since this, it came so quickly that I didn't get to, um, it's just cat food and cake, and I think I definitely did these. I didn't get to, like, play all weekend or anything while I was editing. It was kind of sad, I'm not gonna lie considered opening Minecraft for like the first time in a couple of years, I think. But I just watched other people stream instead. A food and cake is what it was. I think those were the only two things on sale. So I think I did... Let me just make sure I also ordered them. I don't think I did because I was afraid of accidentally going over. Um... Oh wait, no, they're not on sale. They're expensive, right? Yeah, okay. Never mind. I'll I'm clearly not awake yet. I took a really good nap earlier. And yeah, not quite awake yet. I needed it. Please leave. Thank you. All right. And, oh my gosh, this line came out of nowhere, I swear. I mean, I know I was in the back room for a second, but Jesus. Have a nice day. Um, here's what our overflow is looking like, if anybody's curious. This is all lasagna now. Still have that beer left. I don't know why we went through the other beer so much faster than this beer, but whatever. One sack of beef, one sack of yogurt, some pizzas, a couple of these things left. Uh, some more pizza. All this is bun back. These are just empty boxes now. And then one of these book boxes. And then this is all of these fabric softener that I ordered, I think, at the end of last time. That might have been offline, though. Um, so we're getting through it. Sure, we'll replace it at one point. I had a lot of, uh, no sales days, so. Kind of puts a damper on 
going through stuff. He's like, I'm going to buy a keg for later and a beer for now. I see you guys. Free game. I get it. Have a nice day. Now we're, if I'm standing here, I get nobody in my line. If I get up and walk away to do stuff, suddenly everybody's in my line. I think the first license, let's see. Point in case. Listen, sir, you saw me walk away and still went to my register. Whatever. Um, anyway. Oh, no, no. What did I do? This one. Wait, my bills right. Oh no, I did it. Okay. Um. This one we don't have a space for. Oh, chips. Yeah. Oh, chocolate spread though. Pop. Ooh, I think I only have one spot in the fridges for pop. And bottled water. And we need three. We'll have to get another fridge. This one I definitely don't have space for. Books I have space for. We'll just have to resort where they go. There's more cake and chocolate down here. And then more alcohol. We'll need another shelf for alcohol. Ugh, we need more space, guys. We need, just need more space. Um, I could move this. The problem is, like, I'm just kind of, like, out of room. Um, and I don't have the money to go buy an expansion. We could get an expansion... But then we couldn't get any licenses right now. So. Yeah. Might just have to pack it in. I just don't know where. Because, like, we don't really have... I guess I could make this aisle a little bit smaller and scoot them down a little bit. I don't know. We'll start with books, though, because that will be the easiest to kind of, like shuffle things around and get them in i think also having more books means we'd go through books left less often we already have one two spaces and i think we get six books one two three four five six yes um ooh, four eight wait how many books do we have we have six right yeah i'm gonna do four five six so we have 12 books total one, two, three, four, times four, 16 spaces. That's awkward. Well, we could also just put something else on this end cap and just use these three spaces for books. That's also an option. And then that would give us space for other things as well. Oh, exact change. Thank you, sir. I very much appreciate it. Mm, there we go. Darcy Blue. I am a little nervous about reducing down the number of books just because, like, we already kind of like go through them. Um, but I'm sure maybe just having more books will it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I think we can easily reduce down this stuff to one item, and then hopefully we can get more money, and then like we'll have spend. I feel like I just don't make very much money, and I guess it's because I spend it all on, like, store room stuff, but, like, a lot of our storage stuff we go through every day, so it's not like I'm keeping too much extra. I guess I do keep two stores worth, but... I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm sure I'm missing something very important. We could, we could probably move this forward quite a bit, like up to here maybe. Maybe that would be too small, but maybe by one. Hmm. We'll have to squeeze it in. Now the pop, oh, sorry. Switching out the game. Somebody's beep is like right next to my ear. It's crazy.
Um, pop and water. How much are we getting? Um, water. Soda can. I wonder if that's on the shelf. Chips. So there's water and then... Oh, yogurt. Interesting. And then it's only nine levels to the next one. Maybe water. That's all we need. Um, we could just move over. I like the Roy G. Bib of this, though. So. Just put it on the bottom. It's not a big deal. Um, yogurt. We can move the cream over here. I guess. Or I just move the butter because, like, it takes us ages to go through that amount of butter. So maybe we move the butter over there. Move the butter over... Or, um, I think the butter is the best option to put down there. And then we could put milk up top and then another row of the yogurt. Then it's yogurt, cream, and milk. Makes sense. I mean, it would make sense to also have butter over here, but... That's fine. We could also reorient the shelves. We could swap these two shelves and then swap these two shelves and then that would make more sense too. The hummus is only the weird thing that's in this in this fridge. Like why is it here? But the hummus can be moved too if we need to. Because we could easily just fill this with cheese. And then butter. And put the hummus somewhere else. I don't know, man. Last customer of the day. I think I'm going to get books first, though, and that'll be, like, I think more than half our money. Peanut butter, honey, beer, ice cream. I get it. The essentials. Have a nice night. 87. Mashed potatoes and masuka. Uh, masuka, mashed potatoes are. Hmm, if I were mashed potatoes, I would be somewhere really cool. How are the mashed potatoes? Oh, there they are. It's like, I have no idea. Okay. That's cool. Let's light on for you guys and me guys. And we're going to get this one. Just half our money. Oh, the last one we got was books too. That's funny. All of these books, we're going to get four boxes each, I think. Two, 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 three, four, two, three, four, and then two, three, four. I'm just going to go ahead and buy it because I want to get these on the shelves. Um... I don't really have space in here either. Uh, I guess I'll just figure that out when I do. I guess I'm going to reduce down the books to one shelf. And I guess we'll see how that goes. The problem with doing that continuously is that I, I can't get more restockers. So... Problem. Um, problem here is so fighting with them. I have to fire them so that I can do this effectively without being a pain in my ass. Um, I'm just kind of emptying for now and we'll just put new stuff on and see where we're at from there. Oh, that's not going to help me at all. That's not going to help me even a little bit. Or that one. Or that one, okay. 
I need an empty box. Guys, I know it's a mess. Just, just let it be. Please. Okay. Shoo. I think I want to put... Um... What do we have? There's so many books. I think I want to put the kids' books here. Let me just make sure that I have everything in here. Yes. Okay. I am going to just... So, so nice to have them doing this while I... Or restocking while I do this, though. Um... I leave. Let's... I have... They have that on the shelf. I'm gonna leave these where they are. Another. Okay. And then I think I'm gonna move these guys. So A, B, C. This one. Uh, it's share and colors. This in there. Um, and then the share book. Um, that one here, I think. Luckily, these don't have very many on the shelf, so... Okay, I'm gonna put these on this shelf for now. So they'll put those there whenever it gets to that. Um, croc. Really those should go together. Um, I feel like the ABCs should go next to the colors, though. Hmm. It's like the kids' book section. See that I won't share. Maybe I have a Donnie at the top. These are pretty much all kids' books, but it's okay. I think I'm going to move the rainbow books there. Move the mother books up. Please, select the thing, please. Before they come. Okay. Um, okay. Just call the surprise book. That's fun. That there. Actually, I'm going to put this in my stash. Just had to use one. And I think I like the idea of the colorful ones being on this side. Let's put you here. You there. Um, don't let me forget to set prices. I think the color ones up front will kind of grab people's attention, I think. And then this one. Clap. Set these prices. Oh, ten dollars for a book. Let's go. I don't know why, but this one's always hard to get to. Okay. They just keep getting more expensive. Those are all old books. In a perfect world, we wouldn't charge for children's books. It would just be free. So that kids would always want and have the book that they want and have. Okay, books. Cool. That looks good. And then we can put something else new there. So that works. Um, let me turn on this light. I got books there. Do I like that there's only one shelf of books? Not really. Is there much I can do about it? Again, not really. That's okay. We work with what we have. They'll clean up my mess. Or they won't. Sometimes they just don't pick up boxes. I don't know why. They just took that box for some reason. Sometimes they just really like working on the like the like my heels and then, you know. We definitely don't need chicken today. Get some fries in here. 
Oh, there's one pop in here. It's pops full. Yeah. Funny. Okay. Um. Let's see. Did we pay our bills? Yes. Let's get all the things that we desperately need, and then, um, we'll get the things on sale. Ice cream full out here, I'm guessing. See what I'm talking about? They won't pick up this box. Why? Or this box. They just decided those boxes are not necessary. I don't know why. Can you tell me? Or this box. Hold on, one's extra. Strange stew situation. And you, you're probably like, it's because they're busy. No, they're not. There's two of them standing outside right now. I don't know why. Where there was. Okay, maybe there's not. Maybe they are just busy. Maybe I'm just being a little crazy. I've decided that, like, my threshold for buying stuff will be if it's in single digits. Um, just because that seems to be, like, a good... We'll run out that day if I don't get it. You know what I mean? Because I used to go by box count, but that's just so unnecessary. It smells like pumpkin spice in here because I drank pumpkin spice coffee this morning. Just because I felt like it. And I can make my own coffee and do what I want. Um, but I went to take that nap and I forgot to turn off the heater, like, the coffee warmer that I have. So just, like, kind of, like, boiled it continuously. So it just smells like pumpkin spice in here. Which I'm not mad about. See, I don't know in this situation if I should just go and order it. I don't know. I also just break my own rules sometimes. Toilet paper green. Mostly because, like, the big box items we just don't have the storeroom of. Like, the smaller box items, so... Uh, I'm not sure if these will run out, but we'll just keep an eye on them today, I guess. I only do this because, like, it's necessary to get the next box in because I don't have storage space for the other boxes. And I don't want to overfill my overflow just because they're dumb. So let's get this, and then we can get the Masuka. Let's get ten of those. It's a lot, but it'll be worth it. Potatoes. Yeah, okay. We got there. Not too bad. We have 16,000 left, which means we only need to get... Oh, um... Okay, storage is 5,200, which is good. 31,000, so crazy. Um, we need to get... Double our money and then some, and then still find the places to put things? Toothpaste is cool. Toilet paper and paper towels and fabric softener is not cool. Um, you can put toothpaste here. Um, fabric softener we can put there. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we don't have a space for the toilet paper. Now, what I was thinking is I could... I was thinking about moving this aisle here, but... Would it be weird to have an end cap here? Like a short aisle end cap? kind of don't want to bring stuff into this aisle anymore. I could rotate it. Then this is not like facing that, which is fine, I guess. Do this. I'm only experimenting with this right now because they're still restocking stuff, so I have, I have time. What if I did something like this? And then put an end cap here. Would that be too small? Alternatively, though, Kim, okay, yeah, we bring this out this way. You could put, like, a shelf here. Like, there's room to put a shelf here. I mean, not really, but there kind of is. I think an end cap would fit there. Um, what else do we have in the back? Let me see. What do we got back here? We got a register. That does not help us. Oh, yeah, and this thing. 
which also I think just takes up a bunch of space and doesn't really give us much. Oh no, this is, yeah, this is the big like, let me just move these out of my way while I'm looking, looking over here. Cause you could put this thing in cause we have all this extra space over here. Then we could put, it just gives us less space. That's the problem. It's the same amount of space as those two shelves. It just is more space taken up on the floor. And it's like, that's not, I think I just need to sell this thing. I don't think I'm ever going to use it. Cause it's just not useful. It just takes up so much space and gives us so little. Okay, I think I'm going to put this on the back end here. I'll do something like that. I might need to pull that out a little bit. That's not annoying to get to, I don't think. I think I'm putting a small shelf like the milk shelf here. And then we can put the toilet paper on it. And that would be all of that solved for this smaller license. Okay, um, I could also alternatively bring this out, like here, like we had it, and then put the two, we could put two shelves in there, two small shelves, maybe, will that fit there? Uh, maybe not. I have to bring out a little bit more, which we can do, just need to see how much more. Let's bring this out this way. I'm going to line it up that stair. And this would have to come all the way out to here. Put this in there and see what it looks like. Yeah, that could work. And then we could put something there eventually. Okay. Um, okay, I'll put that back then. That'll be our plan. Going forward. And this doesn't stick out too far. I could even pull these out a little bit more. Like so. I mean, it's negligible the distance, but it would just feel a little bit wider here, and then it would give us room for that shelf. Okay, and for now, I'll just put this here, and then we'll just plan to fill in that space. Because if I put it out here, it'll stick out, like, this much, I feel like, and then that gets a little tight, especially around a corner. Okay, are you guys done? Let me just double check, do a quick double check here, because I think they are done. None of these are in the single digits. That's a little sketch, but it's fine. We need egg. Uh, galettes. What's I take? Medium. Whoopsie daisy, just waste of money over here. Uh, milk, I guess. It's fine. We got a lot on the shelf. Let me check these books. Oh, gosh. Oh my gosh, what have I done? I'll probably sell this register for the extra money. You know, it kind of feels like cheating. Uh, this should probably be enough for those books okay let's order these things that is an order we have new books let me make sure i set prices on everything because we know how i like that to do that okay they're good let's open boys we got new you didn't i got i got it don't worry about it oh how did that literally just happen it's because I ordered it and they didn't come out here and grab it. So, I don't know what's going on. Maybe I should reload. Maybe I'll reload after this day. Because that's what happens is sometimes they just... They got these though. I don't know. Got a good stream of people coming in. Look at all these people coming to my store. All these people come to my store. 
You definitely want the street to be like empty of people when you start the day. That's definitely a strategy. Okay, what else do we got? Now we've got room for okay, the next license we're gonna get is um this one. So we have room for all those. We'll just have to buy a small shelf. Um yogurt I can make room for because we're gonna reduce down the butter. Sugar, chocolate powder, chocolate bar, cake and cake. Okay, we have one, two, three. Okay. One, two, three items that can go here, I think. And I don't like that they won't have a secondary, but I'm thinking I could put a small shelf, like, maybe here. That might be too close to the door. Possibly, we could do that. It's okay to split up things. <laughs> but I'm just thinking it'll be, like, you know, on either side of the registers that we'd have all the chocolate and candy and cake. Um, the cocoa powder could potentially go here. I was kind of thinking that for this chocolate spread. Um, and then sugar. The sugar aisle is kind of full, but we can move that down. We have so much sugar. I don't know why they're giving us another sugar product. How many different types of sugar do you need? I think I have like two, maybe three types of sugar because I'm lazy. You literally only need to buy like one sugar. You just get sugar, like normal white sugar, and if you want powdered sugar, you blend it, and if you want brown sugar, you put add molasses. Like, you don't need to buy the other ones. I'm just lazy. But I think we have like three brands of powdered sugar. Do you guys buy different brands of powdered sugar? I buy the same brand that my parents bought, my grandparents bought. Probably it's bad. I'll probably learn that it's got something terrible in it eventually, but like... Actually, I don't. I don't buy name brand sugar anymore. We buy Great Value, I'm pretty sure, which is just the same thing with a different label and price. I don't know. We buy, like, sugar once every, like, three years. Same with flour, because, like, we don't bake or cook, so... We buy sugar literally so we can add it to our coffee. <laughs> Which is like maybe two tablespoons a day that we use sugar. So I don't buy it very often. I'm just looking for anybody to complain about prices. I keep an eye on that so we can keep the number of customers we have. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What am I thinking? That's 60 cents. I was going to give her $60. She's like, I'll take the $61. Thank you. I don't think we've run out of these very often, so it'll be okay to reduce it down. It'll also look nicer, too. I don't know if that'll be the next easiest one to get in, though. The problem is that chocolate spread I would also want to put on the condiment aisle, but that'll be full. We put the cocoa powder, but maybe the cocoa powder should go with, like... Uh, I would say sugar. Like, flour, maybe? Because, like, what do we have with the flour? Oh, the oils. That's right. Yeah, we'd ideally go here. Maybe we could put it on the small shelf. That wouldn't make s That would make sense. Um. But we have, like, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's annoying. Because we only have four shelves that we're going to have over here. It's only half shelf, too. Oh, not 4,000. 14,000. 1,400. Numbers are hard. That's why we have machines to tell us what we need. I think these are okay. Now that we have more variety of books, I think that's helping. Um, definitely need an expansion. Do I maybe just, like, save up my money and just get an expansion? We can fit all this in, but if we fit all... We'll just... I don't know where these cans go. I don't know if they go on the shelf or not. We need two shelf spaces for cans. We can put it here, or we could reduce this by half and put them here. I mean, that's only one shelf each. 
But we can move the milk over here and then have just cans here. Okay. We can do that. I give the spot of water in the two cans. I don't know. The cans might go in the fridge, though. And if they do, then we'll have to get a whole nother fridge. Because, well, we could get a half fridge. Yeah, we could do that. Thank you for your purchase. I would ideally like more money next time, but every dollar counts. <laughs> Daryl, pick it up, bro. Your line's in my line. Oops. You guys are all slacking. Oh, sorry about that. Just standing on your groceries. Hey, we sold a yogurt. Let's freaking go. And a new book. Have a nice day. Thought it was the old guy. Oops. Just the chick. Oh, this is a guy. it's still a guy. I thought it was a girl. Whatever. A gal, if you will. Hurry! Like half of our stock. $100 order, though. I'll take that. Take that over a $3 soda every day. Any day. My mouth could catch up with my brain. That would be nice. I was just so soda selling well today. Okay, now I look like the slacker with my line getting into Steve's line over there. Is the chicken also for the cats? Got this one. Just go out of order here. I have to like process if I gave them the right amount of change every time I do it. Whoa, where's the mayo, boys? So it's, it's on the shelf. He's just impatient. Yeah, the problem is I'm. I need to. I need more restockers because they're having trouble keeping up with the tide. But I, I can't. Okay. That's why it's it's rough to reduce down the number of books and stuff because it's just gonna hurt them ultimately. But it is what it is. That'll probably kill our stats for the day, which sucks. I'll have to play another day before we can get a license. People, is this like majorly on sale? Like, we've been going crazy. No, it's like. Maybe I should raise the price on stuff. No. It's weird. I wish this was an actual cutout in the layout so I could put like. But then I could put the little mini fridges with pop in here and it would look so cute. Alas. Alright boys, your chance to catch up where you've been slacking. Big orders here. Big order thing. Okay. So you could go ahead and move the butter. I'm thinking about it. Uh -huh. While we're here, oops. just throw the butter down here. One stack of butter. I wish you could mark tag like don't refill. That would certainly help. Is that butter full? I think it's too full to get what's in here. We'll still need like a whole box.
Get me a box. There it is. Uh, we can move the milk up. Oh, I have no milk box. So we need to be filling milk. Just don't have a milk box. Milk box. Do, 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 do. It's actually a good thing because then they won't come and steal my box. Or my. They won't fill the spot. Do, do, do. Okay, future home of yogurt. Got it. It's the end of the day. Oh, we hit a hundred! Let's fucking go! A hundred and two customers. Nice! We finally did it. All right, we're closing down the stream. We hit the we hit the number. Dark roast ham ham pastry. Dang, hundred and two. That's crazy. I was it. Oh man, that lucky. Maybe it's because we increased our licenses. I think if you increase your licenses, that's whenever like the number goes up. But we've been like straddling, striding. Straddling the line for like a long time. Uh, hand pastries. It's crazy. It's good though. That's what we need. That's why we we're running out of everything. Let's see here. Get to the ones where there's like nothing in the box. Yeah. So I can get my small box back. Well, I use this other one too. Just because it's nice to have a few extra. Just in case. So hard to reach these top shelves. Whew. That's one goal, personal goal set, so that's good. Turn on lights here. And turn on lights back here. I actually don't know why people want them separate. <laughs> kind of liked having both lights on the same switch. Um, I just say you can pre Oh, it's just because it's unlocked. We can't purchase these. We don't have the money. Bills. Alright, so we have space for the next two licenses. After that, we'll see where we go from there. Uh, we kind of need to fill in what we're missing here. Today will probably be a heavier order day because we didn't order that much yesterday. But uh, we'll see. Um, is any of that stuff that we... I don't think any of that stuff was on sale. What was it? Ham. Uh, oh wait. Ham. Oh, it's coffee, yeah. Pulling up. Okay. Hopefully we don't need any of that. I did buy an extra box. Oh, it looks like we might. Do we have any pops over here? Potato croquettes? I don't think so. Oh, mashed potatoes and soup over here. Oh, here's some fries. Accidentally ordered extra at one point. It's probably because they weren't picking stuff up off the street. Wouldn't be me. I'm not the problem. Hmm. Might come a day when we have to buy yogurt again. That'll be weird. Um, lasagna, I'm a sir. Looks like we move the cheese pizza on over. That's not the way I intended to do that, but I'm not mad. <laughs> Alright, uh, beef. Do you want beef, anybody? No. So weird. It's, you would think that like the staples would sell first, but they don't. And then these books, I gotta remember to put these books. I'm trying to think if we want to move stuff around. I think what I might do... No, oh, these are tall shelves. I'm gonna say put all the books here and then maybe move this stuff. 
Maybe I'll move the potatoes out of here because they're kind of just like in the way. Let me do that real quick. This is my potato fort. Okay, and then we'll put ketchup here. I'm not going to be bothered with fixing it right now because, you know. And we'll put milk here. And then if we wanted to, we could expand out that pasta and stuff into these spaces. And then that'll be four books. Oh, we actually need that to be... Um, I don't want to put the potatoes here. Let's move this stuff, since this is all overflow anyway, over here. It's not ideal, but... This shelf can just become a permanent extra. It's sure. So, it's fine. And then this can all be potatoes. I don't think it needs to all be potatoes, but a portion of it can be potatoes. Something else can go there. And then we can move these books over here. Just so I can see everything better. And I'll reshuffle these boxes since we're still kind of waiting for them to finish restocking. This will probably all change immediately because, like, something new will come in and we'll need space for it, but... We'll figure it out. We can also very cheaply expand our storage. It's not expensive at all. Um, it's not a big deal. But now we have all the books over here. That's good. Um, that's just overflow again. It can become not overflow. We have a few spots in here that we can fill though, so we'll see. Clutter cream, prosciutto. Clutter cream is just sour cream. I don't know why I always call it creme, creme fresh. Did it used to be called creme fresh? Yeah, it says on the box creme fresh. That is everything. Do we need a lasagna over here? Mimisuka. Yeah, let me put this in. They are starting to put things on the shelf now. Makes me motion sick. It doesn't help that I run everywhere. It also might just be watching. There's certain games that like I can't watch, but I can play, if that makes sense. Although then again, I tried to play Raft, and I could watch people play Raft, but I can't, I can't play it. It made me very motion sick. It doesn't help that I run everywhere, I'm sure. I try not to because I know it's like a little thing. And I did move my sensitivity down. It's just how it is sometimes. I think I don't think the movement in this game is very it's kinda jerky. I wonder if this has motion blur. Hopefully not. That's what always makes me sick is motion blur. It's playing that makes you sick, yeah, that makes sense. I can understand that. That sucks. I mean I spend so much time just sitting here and organizing boxes. I'm sure as the game like progresses, it'll get a little bit better. But usually, like what I'll, I recommend is if it's making you motion sick, you probably need to turn down. Like this has in the settings, you can turn down your uh, mouse sensitivity without changing your computer settings, and that's probably all you have to do. I definitely had to because my mouse sensitivity is very high on my computer normally because you don't want to do a lot of wrist movements but in the game you can't really have that when it's first person a lot of other people have the same issue with the game though which i saw people posting on discord ah oh, interesting i'm glad this is not one for me because like i'm addicted to this game i have a problem yeah usually it's motion blur that's and a lot of first person player games you can disable that i don't there is a little bit of motion blur on this, but it's not too bad. The next license is 34000 so we are not going to probably get it today. But we did have to put it in a big order, so that's probably why. It is a good game. It's a good game, and like, I enjoyed the game even whenever it was on the first release, and now it's on version 0.2, and it's still a great game, like... I'm sure I'll get sick of it at some point. I did take a break for a little bit before they got the restockers. 
wrap the movement while playing like having to run around and put boxes everywhere and stuff yeah it it has helped now that we have the restockers that pick up stuff from the street that's helped a lot because you don't really have to like do any box manipulation if you don't want to especially if your store is small enough you could just hire all the restockers and literally you just buy things and like cash people out and that could be your whole job i tend to help just because um they do it wrong and i'm uh probably borderline ocd if that's a thing if that's a thing i am definitely that i'm like if i had if i had ocd then it's I have OCD, but I also have the gene of I don't I give up I don't care anymore. Oh, I probably need potatoes. Mm. Yeah, I don't know if they're gonna do. It. Yeah, it'll be nice if like there's so many improvements to this game that it'll just be like quality of life updates. Um, but yeah, like just having them pick stuff off the street was huge. Um, but there's definitely a lot of small little things that could be done before the full release that'll be nice um but yeah like where you can pick things up without a box that'll be nice i've just used like the empty boxes to kind of like be placeholders so also i'm a millennial so i like a good box i can't just throw away a good box i could probably reach over and pull out an empty box that i'm keeping because it's a good box <sighs> i'm gonna leave it it's fine let's open the store I like that they should update the game and improve it a lot. It has so much potential. Yeah, and he just recently went and hired a, like, um, a few people, like a game uh, development team. That's the word I was looking for. Um, so it's only going to be bigger and better updates from here on out, I can guarantee. Because, like, he was doing, like, small little fixes in between, like, whenever he had his free time. But since the game, like, went crazy, he took, like, a month off to hire people and then released the customization update. Which was really good. And, um, can only get better. All I need him to do next, the most important next thing, is give me more employees. Desperately need more restockers. You came in here, bought books and cheese, and that, he was on it. I did not check the street before I opened. The this is what happens when I nap before the stream. Are we good? Maybe. There's nothing in this bowl. Look. There's nothing in there. Now there's your whole face. She's licking an empty bowl. Did you get it? No, don't bite the bowl. Okay, I've pet all three of you. Go sit down and go back to sleep. A level system for the workers? Ooh, yeah, that would be really good, too. Like, if they could get better at their job, like, more efficient, that would be really nice, too. It's just, like, where I'm at the max capacity of, like, what my three stalkers can physically do, even if, like, maybe, like, if it could, like, speed up. Like, if they could walk faster or something or carry, like, two boxes at once, that would be really nice. But, yeah. We also just, if you missed it, we just hit 102 customers yesterday, so I'm curious to see how many will- Oh, gosh, oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. She's rambling away over here. <laughs> Please ignore the squeaking toy in the back. I definitely don't have dogs in this store right now. Um, but yeah, like, it, just small stuff like that. Because, like, I mean, we could ne not necessarily need more employees if, like, they were just more... They do more. That's true. Steve and Daryl do sometimes have lines that go into my line. I wonder I wonder what's on like their highest priority list. They have it whenever you load the game, they have like a this is what's coming. Um, but it's not necessarily like in a like order or anything. Three chickens. Okay. Um, we need to get, what was it, $13,000 today? Hmm. 
I don't know if we're gonna make that. Did I pay my bills? Yes. Another 11,000. That's certainly not helping much. Twins! Thank you. Oh, exact change too. Daryl, we've talked about this. Your line's in my way. Um, anything that I need to help with? Need so much space. Maybe I should stop prioritizing new licenses and prioritize space. It's just, I want the new things. And like, buying space in between, like, leveling up for the new license is like the way to go because what else you gotta do but reorganize the store? And every time I buy more space, I gotta reorganize the whole freaking store. Because it doesn't flow anymore. Three alligator books! My guy, what are you thinking? Goodbye. Oh my gosh. Daryl! What are you getting? Only 300 item orders? That's not even a big order. Come on, man. Oh, hello. Yelling at my employees. Don't mind me. We're getting toothpaste on the next license, though. That'll be exciting. He's bored. I don't even have a line. Daryl has a line. Um. Oh, spaghetti. Yikes. Let me get that for you guys. Um. Sorry about that. Okay, that didn't help much. Uh. This is why I complain about them like not organizing the boxes, because they'll come out here and get a second box with one item in it, and then like just takes them three times longer to restock one shelf. Frustrating. It is a pizza and three bottles of wine. I'm sorry about your recent breakup, lady. Get over him, he's not worth it. Or her. Or them. Get over them, they're not worth it. By vegetables. Yogurt sale. Oh, nine, nine. Okay. I don't think I've gotten a two hundred dollar order today, which sucks. Still got people shopping, which is good. Are we out of anything? Mayo's looking pretty scarce. What do be liking their mayo lately? Come on, potato pops. Um, you know? Luckily, I don't think we have too many people still. So... Oh, I lied. There's two right there. little one. I went through all those chocolate picks again. It's crazy. Sometimes I don't know if like helping them refill stuff is helping or hurting because like I don't know if it like resets their queue and like that takes more like time than if like they just did it themselves. I just don't know. <gasps> it's me, it's me, it's me. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hello, I'm here here the whole time. Excuse the person standing right in front of you. She's weirdo. Thank you. All of them have long lines. It's gonna be one of those days, eh? 
I don't think anybody else is shopping. Man, they like wrecked the store today. Oh my goodness. Maybe we got over 100 customers again. I ain't mad about that. We didn't meet our goal, so we'll have to run another day before we can get another license. Which is fine. I want to try to get at least a second license today. That's the goal. Now we hit the first two goals. What we got here? Eh, pretty small order, all things considered. How about you? Hmm. You're already almost ready to check out. Ooh, that's a pretty good one. One sixteen. One thirty seven. Stand on my perch here. Yeah. The cashiers can move just a little bit faster. <laughs> Training system would be nice. I don't even know if that's on the list. Um, more employees would be nice. Although, I don't know. I feel like having more registers will look kind of silly. Getting the flipped registers was so huge. We got that. I wish we could change the color of the registers. It's the only furniture by store that's like white. Everything else I have like emofied. Why you gotta get so much stuff this late at night? Come on, man. You really need that shampoo? That was mean. I'm sorry, I apologize. I have the shampoo for free. Pretty sure my husband though only uses like soap. But he gives his hair like really shaved close. Okay. 106 new personal best. Although we got less store points. I don't know what I don't know. I guess it's just number of items sold. Does it say that? No. Oh. I only got ten thousand today. Dang. Uh, limp seed oil and dish soap durian. Durian soap. And oil. Uh, let's try five dollars. See if we can get away with it. Sure, why not? Here are bills. Go to the market. Soap is what's on sale. I already have so many, it's fine. I'll just order it. I always do it because it's better to buy it cheaper than when it's more expensive. I will say after the most recent update, clicking in and out of the computer did make me, like, a little queasy. So I don't know what they changed on that, but... I have to just make sure to not move my cursor while it's, like, zooming out of the thing. Okay. You guys pick up stuff on the street? Let's go. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. It's been so much time, like, getting rid of the, like, three in a box, two in a box, four in a box. Don't win. Wish they were so much smarter about that. They used to be. They used to only do one product per guy per the time, but... Not anymore. Once I get everything in, we'll kind of know where we're at, and then we can finish up our restocking. Man, ne nearly two days. Have we only run two days? Or has it been three? Nearly two days has filled up the, like, bar because we have so many customers now. It's just deja vu because I buy the same things every day. <laughs> okay. I feel like we're right back where we started on these, this money, but it's been nice. Some days are better than others. Okay. Get a few more boxes in. Let's make sure the streets are fairly empty. Looks like they are, so I'm going to go ahead and open. Um, just because the less people on the street, the more customers you'll have. It's already on. I only see... I only saw like two or three.
We just need a cool 9,000 today, which I hope I think we can get. We can get that no problem. All right, people. I need you guys to get in shape. We got to get so many customers today. We need hundreds of customers. We could double our inputs, then we can double our output, you know what I mean? Synergy. Uh, what's the other things that Corby people always say? Uh, teamwork and is it product placement. I oh, freaking out. No idea what I'm saying. We got this. I should have gotten more water. Uh. Lily, you still got an hour before I'm done. You're so very cute, though. Chip tea, that's what sounds good. Oh, good morning. Thank you so much for buying more than one thing and only one book. Have a nice day. All right, more sales like that. Oh my gosh, this ice cream is pitiful, guys. This, this is how we're starting our day? Really? Well, it's actually kind of full. It just you know, looked kind of pitiful. Whatever, I'm helping. Teamwork. This is Good work, boys. Keep it up. Steve's line is free. Craig's line is free. Did I ever name the last cashier? I don't feel like I did. Have a nice day. Ha have a nice day. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> There's like a place for me to stand. There's not like a place anymore. I guess I could stand here. This little like pocket I've created. Oh, it's like, you guys are on my register, right? No. Daryl again. Daryl once again. Slacking behind. Did I set the prices? What did we get? We got soap and... Yeah, dirty and soap and something else. I definitely remember setting that. Sorry for these guys in Daryl's line here that are in your face, but... How it be? It's rush hour, guys. Pick up the base. I'm getting any hundred dollar orders is just making me quite nervous. That's what will be. Maybe this one will be. $200 orders, not bad. Premium him. Have a nice day. Maybe I should just scam people. And I'll have more money. Daryl, are you getting only big orders? What's happening? I guess they're all kind of like in the same spot. The Ray baits us. Have a nice day. That's what I'm gonna eat after I'm done with this. I'm gonna eat me some pizza. The pizza we got yesterday, I don't know what's different about it. I always order the same thing generally. Um, but it was so cheesy. I always order extra cheese, but like nine times out of ten, they ain't giving me extra cheese. They just like charge you more for the same amount of cheese. 
But this last time, they loaded it up. They loaded it up. There's probably a little bit too much sauce, but it was like cheese pool city. Like, great. It's the best pizza I've had in like a long time. I just got a bacon cheese pizza. It was great. Oh, I'm so sorry. I thought I clicked. Oh, God. When I was joking about the theft, I was joking. Fuck. I don't know what that affects. I think that affects the number of customers we get the next day. Oh, she's never coming back. Thanks. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can help with anything. Mm. Green beans we can snag real quick. Basically anything that is two or under be good to help. Oh god, the chicken. The chicken, boys! The chicken! I wish, I, you know, another great update was be able to get a trash can that you can put in your store so they don't have to, like, walk out to the front. I hate that stupid thing. At least I don't have to do that anymore if I don't want to. That's been a huge game game improvement. Um, quality of life update. I hate that thing. Ding! Okay. Uh, more chicken probably. Nah, they're okay now. Um, the spread is fine. No, I have a customer. Milk is okay. Scallops are running low. Oh my god, we're out of cat food. Oh my gosh, we're out of cat food. Oh, Jesus, side o'clock. Sorry if you guys want that cat food. Your cat's just gonna have to suffer. Sorry. There's like three grocery stores in this neighborhood. Go, go get cat food from there. Uh, okay. Oh, they figured it out. Okay, yellow cat food then. They found the cat food. We found some extra in the back. No hot sauce. One hot sauce. That's all the hot sauce we have. Ketchup. Customer. So stressful when you have to do more than one job. I mean, I could show my register, but I feel like we have... It definitely lowers our ratings if, like, all the lines are completely full. I'm hoping that they're intelligent enough to say if my line that I chose when I walked in is full, I go to the emptier line, but I don't know. I don't know if the AI is quite there yet. Um, let's see what else we I'm pretty low on potatoes. I don't think anybody else is shopping. Well, there's a couple of people shopping. Not enough, probably, to buy the rest of our products, but I'll throw out some of these just in case. Eh. They're barely keeping up, boys. They're barely keeping up. So we're gonna have chocolate again. We can fit another fridge here. We can fit a small fridge here too if we need to. But I think it's all we'll need to do. It's like so dark back here, but like putting another light in will make it way too bright. You have three, you have three, you're done. Good job, Craig. You know what? You get a promotion. You're second in command cashier boy. The left, the left, the left. Whoever go gets through for their line first wins. What do you win? Uh, a good night's sleep. Yeah, I'm curious. We probably had one or two people complain about products not being on the shelf. I don't know that we ever had completely empty shelves, but we might have. I might have missed it. 
I do wish they would go back if they were still shopping and like we restocked it. I do wish they would be like, oh good, here it is. Or wait a number of, you know, time units for it to be stocked. 104, two not found, yeah. I'm sure changed. Ugh. If we didn't need to buy anything today, we'd have enough money. Tuna, dishwasher tablets, soda, durian. Okay, I didn't see which ones. But... Tuna. Uh, durian soap. Dishwasher tablets. I don't know which ones. These ones? It's always these ones. Dishwasher tablets, durian, tuna, something else. I don't think I'll buy the durian soap again, just because we already bought it a day or two ago. I will buy these again, because having an excess of these is so nice. Hopefully we have enough space for that. Sure we do. Durian soap. Mm. Oh, this soda. Okay. Orange soda. Aren't you glad I didn't say banana soda? Okay. Uh, I feel like it's still fair price. Alright. Always gotta order cat food. It's never freaking dog food. Oh, we do need to look dog food. No, we don't. We're good. I probably need to give two more shelf slots to cat food because I feel like we're running out of that every day, too. Now we sit back and let our employees do most of the work because why else do we pay them? What is this the monstrosity we've created here? I say as I immediately go back to picking up stuff. Um, ba -da -ba -ba -bum. So one advantage that cat streamers, or cat streamers, cat owners will always have is their pets are a lot quieter sometimes. I know cats can also be loud, but generally, dogs are a lot noisier. They're also about to random bouts of barking, which is also very loud. I wish I could put that stuff on a box, it'd be so nice. Oh, I have more durian soap here. I guess I just... I have infinite durian soap. Put it all here. Oh, wait. That's not soap. That's soda. Oh. Put it here. I think I got most of the boxes fixed. That I want to fix. I can't be fixing boxes all day, every day. It's picking up stuff off the street. Good. Mostly it's just to get the overflow count down a little bit. Should be enough space. I'm gonna put these here, I think. Just kind of keep it like separated. I guess this shelf is practically empty, but I don't know. They always put stuff at the end anyway. I just don't like them putting stuff here because like this paint bucket always respawns. Just annoying. Oh, you guys were picking up stuff off the street. What happened? Hello, employees? There's one. Two. Are we playing? Oh, three. I'm playing hide and seek, I guess. Three. Okay. Uh, I definitely didn't order that tea. Oh, didn't do that. Be able to toss it over a little bit closer. Just like the idea of like the glass bottles of the beer just shattering as I toss these boxes. The good thing about those cookies is they're not like. I know this is like a very millennial thing to say, but they're not like overly sweet. They're very like a cakey kind of cookie. I have more of a molasses type of cookie though. I would add like molasses to any type of cookie. Like normal people add like vanilla to like everything. I'm like just add molasses instead. It's got a better flavor. I don't know why that people add vanilla to like every single recipe. It'll be like a chocolate cookie, and they're like, and a splash of vanilla. I'm like, I don't want it to taste like vanilla. It's a it's a chocolate cookie. What do you mean? And they're like, no, no, you add vanilla to everything. I'm like, it's like pepper. Like, people are like, you have to add black pepper to everything. I'm like, 
I don't want my food to taste like black pepper, though. I've added other spices. And they're like, no, a black pepper is just like salt. I'm like, black pepper is not like salt. Salt is a flavor enhancer. Pepper is a flavor. Oh, people don't know how to cook. You don't see, you don't see like, um, chefs adding black pepper to every single recipe. You know what I mean? They only add it when they want the flavor of black pepper. And if that's how the professional chefs do it. I'm not telling how like pi I'm not telling pilots how to like fly a plane. Why am I trying to tell chefs how to freaking cook a meal of water? Okay. I think we're good. Air bills. Somehow we'll have less money than we had yesterday. I'm just guess really bad at this game. I d I don't freaking know anymore. No, it's just because stuff has been on sale and like Oh, I have no potatoes. What am I thinking? I forgot about the potatoes, guys. I forgot they were there. I'll be honest. Yeah, every other day is like a big order day, so I just end up spending a bunch of money. Sorry, guys. You're going to be busy. And I didn't check the street. There's like a bunch of people walking on the street. It's what it is. We tried. I might have to order more potatoes because I think they took them to the shelves. Uh, maybe. Maybe, yeah. It's, imagine being so bad at being the one guy who buys this stuff. I would have remembered at some point. It's fine. I think this will be our last day, though. Sadly, I don't think we'll get another license. We did go a whole freaking level today, though. And we got over 100 customers for the first time, which is great. Um, I just gotta, like, run through some days and get some cash. I, like, raise my cash level so steadily that whenever I make big purchases, it's just... Takes a while. I guess I could like sacrifice buying stuff with the max. I'm just really excited to have all the books. Also, if we wait until next time to get the next license, we can like plan out the store a little bit and not have to like rush it at the end. It's always nice. I think it's so funny they put stuff on like the back of the boxes which you hardly ever see unless you like happen to look at somebody else's register. It's like you're, re you're restocking you don't see it and like whenever you're actually checking people out you don't see it. But you do if you glance at a different register. It's a nice touch. I also hope they add more items eventually. That'd be nice. Have a nice day. Wow, Daryl, come on, man. You already got four people in line. I guess three people online, but still, it's rough. It's only it's only two at p.m. She must add a lot of stuff. Hopefully, his next order isn't big. Oh, it's kind of big. Daryl's having a bad day, guys. Daryl's having a bad day. I need to like run around the store and see if anybody's saying anything's expensive because there's like one item out there that people are finding expensive. Don't know what it is. It's just I'm stuck by the register most of the day nowadays. I'm not doing that. I'm trying to help them 
new stock. So. Alrighty, at 30,000, so maybe we'll hit that today. It's always fridge items. I feel like people are so picky about their fridge items. It's not really affecting us much. Honestly, if we have a few less customers, it's not that big of a deal. Because we get over 100 now. We're definitely at max capacity of how many people we can service in one day. Thank you! I could also just like let a line build up. I don't generally do that. So I can keep an eye on shoppers. I was having a rough go of it. Is this order going to be small? Maybe this one's small, Daryl. Okay, you got a small order. Nice. Wish we could set him as like the express lane so like he could get some small orders for a while. Steve's not doing much better. Oh, I missed it. Somebody said something about something over here. Just don't know what it was. We're out of peanut butter. Like just like one guy. I'm just being one guide over here. Oh, I got a bit of a line. That's what I'm talking about. Like, every time I try to rush around and, like, see stuff, I'm, I get a line. Have a nice day. Buying different books. Look at that. Have a nice night. You know what I appreciate? This game doesn't have, like, a bagging mini game. Like, that would be so annoying. You got ketchup? You got ketchup. Getty again? Oh, we're actually out of a book. Rainbow book. We got a rainbow book. Let's get it. A lot of eggs. You wait, sir. We'll have new yogurt soon. Okay. Oh, still one guy shopping. 
believe he can find everything he needs. Okay. You're no buying a normal amount of books, luckily. Oh, he's just buying all the pink stuff, huh? He's like, if it's got pink or red, I'm buying it. Have a nice day. I think that's all of our shoppers. Oof. This is like just perfectly in darkness. Because I can't put a light here. I could. It would just be like extremely close to that light. Steve was having a go of it too, huh? I'll last or shut that pick at least. We did get enough money. We we'll only have eight thousand dollars or four thousand dollars left over. But with like bills and stuff, I don't know. Oh, nobody found anything expensive. I think I just didn't. I guess I just made it up. Oh, that's a huge price drop. That sucks. Oof. Okay, well, I don't think we're going to be able to get it today because the bills paid 34600 So we'd have like two grand left. That wouldn't even be enough to buy the items that we would get the license for, so... I don't think that's a good idea. We'll have to go one more day. I might play some offline just to rack up some money and like get through some stock again. Uh, maybe not though. I might not have time to do that. But good progress. We have a nice new book aisle. Looks great. Could use more books maybe, but we just have to take up so much space if we did that. I just don't have the room for it because I don't have the money for it. It's crazy that we've spent so much time in this game and we still are just like hurting for money. It's like our one limiting factor. I don't know if like it's just because I just haven't had the chance to expand the store and get more things on the shelf or what. But anyway, that's it for today. Thank you guys. Oh, I clicked out of the game. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys back here next time.